Huddersfield Town Stadium like something from the space age. Now a state-of-the-art development is set to become the new home of Grimsby Town. The Mariners' future looked uncertain when Justice Taylor's report into the Hillsborough disaster recommended that Premier and First Division grounds become all-seater. But it's now been revealed that the club and local authorities are to appoint Kirkley's McAlpine to build a similar ground. A football club is an incredibly important asset to uh, any community. We have a First Division uh, football club. It's tremendous for the morale of the community. It is tremendously important for our companies in terms of attracting and retaining staff to have a First Division football club. And for the Mariners, it would be a welcome move, according to the new chairman who was appointed only last night. It would be a tremendous asset for the club, and not only for the club, but for the town. Um, it's, uh, it would be really um, an achievement. We've achieved quite a lot on the football pitch, and we would obviously now like to achieve a little bit more um, outside of the pitch now. However, it'll be at least four years before any stadium is built. On Tuesday, the club's directors will decide whether to limit seating at Blundell Park to its present capacity of 5,000 or install 3,500 more seats, because the fact remains that from the end of this season, standing at the ground will be banned. And staying with sport, and 1995 is starting with real promise for one of the region's top sporting Three clubs. years since Barnsley's one and only FA Cup triumph. They beat West Bromwich Albion 1-0 in the 1912 final.